California is the first state requiring state employees and healthcare workers to provide vaccine verification or get tested weekly. KSBY News reporter Gina Avalos is live with where you can go to get tested. Gina. Nina, COVID-19 testing sites like the one right behind me here in Santa Maria is more than likely to see an increase of people stopping by. Now, this is something both Santa Barbara and San Luis Obispo County might need to prepare for. State employees and healthcare workers will now need to have proof of vaccination by August or they'll have to undergo a weekly COVID-19 test and wear their masks to work. According to the state, healthcare workers might be subject to testing twice a week, depending on whether they are in areas that require patient care and patient encounters. This comes after the state saw a surge of COVID-19 cases and increasing hospitalizations. Health officials say the Delta variant now accounts for 83% of COVID-19 cases statewide, and the majority of new cases are among those who are unvaccinated. Santa Barbara County currently offers COVID-19 testing at these locations places like the Santa Maria Fair Park accept walk-ins as well as the American Medical Response Center and the Goleta Valley Community Center. In San Luis Obispo County, testing sites at the Paso Robles Centennial Park and the San Luis Obispo Veterans Hall also accept walk-ins. But county sites aren't the only places people can get tested. There are more than a dozen urgent care centers that might also see an uptick in patients. San Luis Obispo MedStop Urgent Care Dr. Brian Roberts says getting the state workers tested once a week could be a challenge. So they might be trying to do on-site testing. If they're having those employees go out and get tested outside of work, uh, that's going to be quite challenging uh, and we would help in any way we can, but that would be difficult. He adds his care center provides three different types of COVID-19 testing options. Exact details on how state employers are going to handle these weekly tests are still unclear. For now, live in Santa Maria, Gina Avalos, KSBY News.